Hey guys, how you doing today? It's me, Kelly. Oh, I said that twice. Oh, anyway, so I'm back. Uh, you know, for those of you who know, I've it's been a while that I've done videos and uh, actually art um, to this extent. So, you know, I just want to come back and play a little bit until I can get back on my horse and, and do things, you know, like different things like I... I'm crocheting and knitting and you know all that kind of stuff learning how to write my own patterns and stuff very exciting stuff so um I thought because I love this so much <laughs> I do I love this background but I know it's busy and I know you know am I going to be able to put something on top of it you know what I mean I'm going to have to wipe some of it out and do all the things so what I thought was if I can get this up I grabbed some like little collage pieces. These are stickers actually. Can I get them off their papers? Who knows? But I got these from Amazon. I got these and I got, um, there's all kinds of different stickers that comes in it. And then I got one that is, um, what the heck did I do? Oh, I didn't, didn't figure out which one I wanted to use. I got all these like, um, you know, Emily's typewriter is downstairs, so I, and if I print out, sometimes it smudges, it smears, and I have the worst handwriting in the world. So I thought, oh, let me just try these, you know. Um, so these are just, I mean, you can get these on Amazon. I think they were like two bucks. Same with these stickers. And I think you get, let me see how many you get of these. They give you like a couple packages, and, um, and I'm not selling them to you, I'm just showing you. They come like this. And there's a lot in each package. I got three of these that came in one package. And I think all together, what's it say? Uh, 180 pieces. So, you know, all these like cute little things like uh, if your nerve deny you, go above your nerve, Emily Dickinson. And uh, my love is selfish. I cannot breathe without you. Oh my God. You know, like just like cute little things and I don't know what I'll use, but and I got like bits and pieces of paper and all the things. So what I thought I would do first is let's wipe some of this out. <laughs> and I have my, um, this is Amsterdam and it's just titanium white, white in the, uh, what's it called? Standard series. Um, I also have some which I'm kind of disappointed in this, but it's a uh, folk art multi-surface titanium weight white can't speak today. And it's kind of like, I don't know. It looks like it might have solidified or something. I'm not real sure. So I don't know about this one yet. I'll have to try that later. So I figured I'll shake this because there's a lot in here. I use this when I pour, but um, I thought today we'll just kind of do this. And I don't, you know, when you have a, canvas and one like this where we have like several different things that can be uh almost competing with each other really um what i like to do is kind of turn it maybe even this way because then you're not like focused on because our eyes when we look at it to me at least um you know you kind of see like oh this is you know i'm gonna knock all that back so i figured i'd do it like that um also I'm going to use a piece of, this is just a piece of cardboard and we all got the cardboard. You don't need to have anything special. Um, somebody wrote me the other day and said about, I had used, I don't know, uh, these, this is what I used. They're from folk art. Now I, I, you know, I folk art, you know, and me had a thing once. Um, so, you know, yeah, I have a lot of folk art stuff and some of their stuff's really good. But I do know that there's a lot of you out there starting. I know a lot of you are uh, in situations like me where you're disabled and you don't get a lot of money in and you can't always go out and buy the next best thing. If you can, like I told you, do a coupon and go buy one thing at a time. That's what I like to do, but that's neither here nor there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look and I'm gonna just kinda go this way and just kind of very lightly I don't want to get too much and then just take this could be a piece of cardboard you got from the Amazon or something in the mail um, you know whatever you have 
old credit card. Okay, so you see how I did that. Now I'm going to turn it this way. And something I like to do <laughs> is take your empty toilet paper or paper towel holder, get some of that, and lift it. And let's just bring it over. And see if you kind of like that with that picking up that uh, some of that white you know I'm gonna be gluing things down but here's the thing when this dries I'm gonna have some of that in there right I also have a plastic cup which you know I do spiders I have spiders so I have a lot of these cups so I can make it bigger smaller whatever and I love because it kind of made it transparent here. So the pink comes through, but it's not like, bam, like that. So all kinds of different things. And you can just pat off, you know? So I like that. Now I'm going to do some in the edges and I don't necessarily have to pick up more. And I'm going to just very lightly scrape it and scrape it doesn't look it kind of did like I don't care because we're gonna pull some of it back All right. okay and you can still see some of it coming up because I am gonna put collage down um, now I might go in and see if I can pull any of that back it's just kind of because the dilutions is not permanent so it's going to lift that a little bit but I can go back in and put something else down which is what I'll end up doing so I just want some of that bright off and then sometimes what I do because I'm wacko and I'm sure other people do it as well I will and see, you just save this and next time I'll use this side and it just will build up and get, you know, you leave it dry. It gets a little thicker and a little bit more sturdy for you. You know, don't throw that stuff away. Um, but I'm going to put this away for now and take this up off here. One thing that I do like to do, and I'm not going to do it right now, is I like to spray water on here and then wipe it off. So it's like pushed back, but it's not. But I know I'm going to put things, glue things down. So I can still see, you know, the majority of what I like. I really like this over here. And I like this little area here. So I'm going to just tap away a little bit of that white. Anyway, it's kind of pink white, but that's all right. We're going to roll with it. Can't help that stuff. Sometimes it's not permanent. And uh, which, you know what I meant to do is show you guys how I use um, fixative. I love fixative. And usually I would spray it on top and then do the white, um, which I'll do in another canvas because I'm going to do a bunch of backgrounds to kind of get into it. But um, I'm going to spray a little bit of water on here. But I didn't do it on this one, obviously. Um, but you can. You can get crown and fixative. You can also put some, um, like maybe you have clear Mod Podge and you want to real quick put it on. Will it lift a little bit? Yeah, it'll lift. But you can see, you know, just a little bit. Now the fixative, if I would go to do this, would lift it off. So we would see exactly what was underneath. But because I didn't, but that's all right. It's all right. And I love this here. And then maybe you have like a little bit of white left on there. You can just kind of go push that back. I love the blue. I'm going to add, I think, a little bit more blue on here. I love that blue. And I think with that light, that'll look pretty. Let's see. Why not? And this just is, in case you're asking, primary cyan. Okay. I wonder if... Ooh, let's do... Let's see. Let's see what we can come up with. Should I have a piece of uh, paper towel down there? I sure should. Oh, see, this is what I love in life. <laughs> this is what I missed. Yeah, 
and just move it all around. And you can see, put a little thick. That's all right. You can see up here. But what I'll do is just spray it again. And I'll take my paintbrush and just wet it a little bit and get it on the corner and just kind of help it. And I'll show you. Oh, yeah. Oh, I love it. Okay. It's all right. It's just paint. And then I'll take my dirty paper towel. I keep these. I hang them like this. This might even have blood on it because I scratch myself <laughs> coming in the door. Don't ask. Um, but, uh, no. So, yeah. So, I'll take this. I never, I always leave them dry. And then I'm just going to pat it like that and then look you can go in with your other thing that you're putting everything on and just pat on it because you're getting all this nice collage paper coming right and these too straighten them out when they dry you can rip these apart and use them as well which I have I have I have all right so I am loving this with the blue I want a little bit more off up here. Just a couple pats. I'm not going to like wipe it, seriously wipe it. But I do want some of that pink to come in. Because I do, you know what I love? Wait a minute. This is what I, wasn't there some blue up down here? I love the way it's kind of like almost framing, framing it in a way. And then you have like this chaos right here because I'm all about the chaos. I think that my life is chaos. <laughs> all right, let me draw this real quick. And this will just help push it. You can use a hair dryer if you don't have a heat gun. If you have a heat gun, don't hold it on there because it'll give you fumes from the plastic in the paint. And this just like pushes it around. Helps it dry a little bit faster. Get going there, little buddy. Get going. And it it shears it out. So which which is what I love because then you could definitely see what's underneath. And remember, you can always go back in with colors underneath to bring it, you know what I mean, to bring it forward. All right. Okay. Oh, so I don't know if I told you in my last video, but one of my uh, very, very, very dear girlfriends in life, in real life, um, passed last Saturday. And um, her mom called me. Uh, and I'm sorry if I already told this. I do apologize. It'll, but um, I had met her when she was 15. They moved in. Her and her mom moved above us in the condo that we lived in. Um, and we were fast friends. We clicked. We hit it off. And that was, geez, I was like maybe 25 at the time. And now I'm like 50, I don't know, 54 or something like that. Um, so, I mean, I've known her a very long time. And we've kept in touch, me, her, her mom, Dave, all these years. Sometimes we might go months without talking or whatever, but we were on Facebook and we would always come back and talk to each other. And I feel, um, I feel very sad. I feel very upset. I feel very, um, you know, for those of you who know, I lost my son and in 2010, which <laughs> seems like yesterday, but I know it seems so long ago. Um, but I haven't been to any memorials or funerals since. And when her mother called me on Saturday and I answered and, or I, she called me and then I called her back and she said, we lost Bren Kell. 
And, um, you know, I, I just couldn't believe it. And I don't think I still believe it. Um, you know, so they're having this memorial uh, slash funeral, I guess, this Saturday coming up. And in honor of her, they want everybody to wear purple because she loved purple. Um, so, you know, or some sort of purple, whether it's, you know, a scarf or this or that. So now I'm just fighting. I have a busy week this week. I have a lot of health things going on this week that I have to do that nobody's letting me get out of, <laughs> um, uh, which I'm not happy about. And um, I have like three things I have to do this week and then Saturday is that. So um, I'm kind of fighting with myself. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know how I'm going to go there. And, you know, number one, I lost somebody so close to me because how many of us stay friends with people that long over 20 years do you know what I mean it's few it's not all you know you lose touch you think you're going to be the best of friends forever but it you know whatever and um like we we love them so much that the mother's um her name is Yvonne her uh car had broken down and she didn't have a car and we had just gotten a newer car and we were going to sell our other car. And instead we gave it to them. Uh, so they had a car. So um, that's how much we just love them. So um, it's going to be very hard. <laughs> so I thought, you know what? I'm going to, I need to do some art. So why not get on here and record? Now, my life is not all uh, dark and dingy and all that kind of stuff. Um, but, you know, it's just... So this month coming up in March, I am not going to do any foster puppies. I'm going to stay. I want to get back to doing some videos and connecting with you guys again. I don't care whether it's one people, one person or 10 people or whatever, um, where before I was so like, oh, my numbers, my numbers. And now I just don't care. I just want to do art. And I'm not going to sit here and bore you with all my stuff. But um, yeah, so... You know that's kind of that's kind of what this week is about so i thought i'm going to come on here again and do some art and uh just got my mind off of it i guess and uh whoever watches watches and i hope you enjoy it and i'm just playing around and that's what i love to do uh so yeah so that's where we're at so it's a little bit uh damp still so i'm gonna just take and i like to take just the end and just kind of Suck it up a little bit. I also um, have my jumping spiders, which I love. I'm so obsessed with them. So I'm going to, I am going to, um, I think Angie asked, record feeding them this week. If all goes well, if I have, if I'm able to. So if not, I'll do it next week or the weekend, you know, once all the hubbub's over. All right. So I'm just trying to. Pat. Okay. Just a little bit, just to get. I'm okay with that though. I mean, and if you're gonna paint, you gotta paint, right? Okay. So next. Okay. So now I'm gonna get some gel medium, and that's modeling paste. Oop, let's do it. And I got golden regular matte medium. Um, and the reason I got this is there was a 50 off coupon at Michael's and I had $10. I had two $5 certificates like on from buying. And I thought, guess what? I'm only going to pay $8 for this. And the Michael's Artist Loft gel medium was even more, it was like 14 bucks. So I was like, oh yes, please golden. So I got me some golden. That's how I got it. I ain't got money coming out my butt. I, uh, I just been using the coupons and I'm telling you that's what helps. So I'm going to rinse this in this water. My husband so lovingly got me so I didn't have to. Helping me try to get back on the journey. And I'm going to go in first with now this obviously I had cut and there's like and I like that. <laughs> I like that. So I think I'm going to put that there. And I'm just going to go in and throw this on the back. Price tag and all, baby. Price tag and all. 
and go ahead and put that glue on. Also, I wanted to get the golden um, because when I started out, I had all golden in Liquitex. Um, and I loved it. I loved the quality. And, you know, when Mod Podge sends me all their Mod Podge and stuff, which I love. I'm not mad at it. But I thought for myself, I'm just going to do it like this. Just this time. I will be still using Mod Podge and everything, but... Now this, I think, I'm afraid, is going to... Because this is matte I got. I did not get glossy. Because I'm not really... If I'm going to do glossy, like something like this, I'll spray it. I'll seal it. Or I will put resin on it. You know what I mean? Or wax or something. Um, so here's what I decided I was going to do. Girl, you're using that mop, that uh, gel medium. Like, you made it. <laughs> I want that stuff to stick. And that's another problem sometimes with Mod Podge. It gets sticky on top. I can't remember if this does or not. And, you know, Mod Podge matte is different than gloss. Um, also, they make Mod Podge paper now, um, which is even better. But it's not as thick. It's like woodery, a little bit more woodery. So, whatever. Okay. So, I'm going to move my white paint. I'm going to do that one. And I, like I said, I know it's going to be flat, and that's okay. I'm going to take this and just like push it down to help so it'll get the extra out and it will uh hopefully now what i sometimes like to do is i'll rinse my brush and get most of the water off i know isn't this nice you get to see my arm and go in and very i do everything ass backwards if I feel that there's too much on top, I can go in like that, and then I can go in. Girl, get a new paper towel, would you? <laughs> I'm right here. I gotta get my art rag. I gotta find it. And then I'll go in. And this isn't necessarily gonna bring the shine back, but you'll still be able to see that blue in there because that turquoise I love because it kind of like flows with that. And if you want to love it more off, because I can see in the corner, I just want to tap that. Oh, God, my mouth. I was going to say something ignorant. I can't. Not ignorant, but if there's kids watching, I can't. Which I doubt there's kids watching me, but, you know. All right. Yeah. All right. So you see, it kind of brings that back a little bit. And what I'm going to do, because I do notice, I have to get Dave to fix this for me, but you can see better when it's like this. And you see there's that little bit of shine, but that's all right. I'm going to do something at the end that's going to make it even better. Now, something I was thinking, should I do this side? Should I do another one of this side? So what I decided was, I'm going to rip this, and I'm going to put down here and then I like to have three of something because I'm weird and I have like weird OCD I guess so I'm thinking about doing it like matter of fact I think I might put that there I might take that off and just kind of lay that there and then do the blue like that oh I wish you guys were sitting here with me so I <laughs> I can say, what do you think? And then a little bit of blue and a little bit of blue. Let's go for it. If I think about it too much and everything's fixable. And let me just say, it's a canvas, right? I'll throw black all over it and start again. So we'll go here and I'm just gonna, you can also put down like this. No matter what you're using, you can use um, Elmer's. Elmer's, um, not school glue, that's water soluble, even though I use it all the time. Um, which just means that I guess if water got on here and I was using it, it would loosen it up. I'm not real sure. I've never had that happen before. And you guys know I always throw in water and paint. However, there is, uh, it's called Elmer's School All or Glue All, Glue All. And it's the same, it's like the same price kind of thing. Um, and you get it at the Walmart or wherever you go. 
and uh, that's good to use too. You, if it's too thick for you, use a little bit of water to thin it down, and that is fantastic. And I have some, I just don't know where. All right, so I'm going to put this one this way. Just do a little, get them sides down, a little bit in the middle, just to get some of those bubbles. And like I said, I'm not going to go clean that again because I have, I'm going to do something on that. And do I want to do... I get See, this is why when I look at it, I get too, too excited. I do want this catty corner. I want it to kind of run into that. Also with this, you don't have to put as much because I notice I'm like slamming it on. But what are you going to do? Okay. I've been reading. I've been reading a lot. I've been obsessed with TikTok, which I am almost ashamed to say, and um, which I love. I don't even know if I could put my videos on there, like how I would edit it down to that. But I do love me some TikTok. All right, and that'll be our third. Scratching that OCD. <laughs> and then one, two, and then I just need, I might go a little bit smaller. And I have this right here that's kind of, dark it's kind of gold so i figure that will kind of make that gold it's a circle i have no punches i don't know all my punches broke and i don't have any because I, I want to get like circle punches and corner punches and all the things um which that's you know when there's another sale and i have more coupons i'm going to start uh getting however um you know i would probably cut some out this to me i love and I'm probably going to go in with, um, maybe, I'll do, maybe I'll do it now while it's still wet. See, I can see it lift in there a little bit. So, um, you know, what have you guys have been watching? Because it's going to take me a minute to do this. We just finished True Detective. We watched um, uh, Fargo, which was we liked. True Detective, I liked. Um, I didn't like the ending. I really didn't like the ending. And there were certain parts of it I really didn't care for. Uh, but overall, I thought it was good. It's worth sitting and watching. Um, and this is just a Stabilo. And I'm doing this because I know I have some glue on my brush that once I do this, I can wet it. And uh, maybe that'll intensify that the slightest bit with the glue. Let's see what happens. It's all about seeing what happened. Um, so yeah, so we've been doing that. RuPaul, yes please. UK against the world. RuPaul and our RuPaul. And which I love. And I think tonight we're gonna watch the Spanish one, start watching it. Um, I just love it. I, their their artistry just blows my mind. Blows my mind. You know, and their stories. I just love it. Anyway. Um, so we've been watching that. Um, <laughs> Dave said to me, must be your lucky day. I'm like, what? He's like, Survivor is starting again. I'm like, yay. I love Survivor. I don't know. I want to do it. That's why. So. Okay. So that, that's not too bad. I'm going to hold it up. I should. Is that better? Yeah, that's better. I need to get... this helps. Does that help a little bit? Yeah, it does, huh? Let me know. Let me know if this helps when I lift this up. Just down below, just say, yep, it helps. Nope, it doesn't. So I'm going to have some blue that's still a little bit white. I'm just going to kind of kind of go with it a little bit here and just kind of flick it. Everybody likes a little flick once in a while. There you go. Okay. And then since I do like this, I do. I might even, oh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm not going to say it until I do it. I'm going to do this part right here. Oh, this is a small stabilo. Same kind of thing. Just running on the edges, you know. Should I wait until it's all the way dried? Probably, but not me. And this is just left over from, um, you know, cutting with the Sizzix. You know the flowers or whatever. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, I'll put it down. <laughs> And you'll see why, I mean, you look at it now and you're like, oh, I don't know, but you'll see. You'll see what I'm going to do. Okay, so I'm going to wipe this. And then I'm going to get just a little bit of um, paste, the gel uh, medium. And kind of just lightly tap it so it goes over it, right? And then I'm going to go in just a little less more here. Yeah, 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 baby. Yes. I like how black it is. Oh, okay. Very exciting. Okay. <laughs> All right. Exciting, exciting. Okay, so then we have that. Then, well, I'm going to thank, let me thank, let me thank. And another trick I want to tell you is, you know, like when you get a canvas from like your um, art store, craft store, sometimes it's like, like uh, you could push it, right? So when I'm done, what I'll do is spray that with water on the back and then spray it on the front and then just leave it dry and for whatever reason it does magic and it will like tighten it up a little bit which is what you want okay all right okay so let me see what else we got what's this say the greatest glory in life lies not in the failing but in the being able to rise again and again. Yes, yes, yes. That's perfect. I could, that, perfect. Because <laughs> I feel like I've been failing and falling and all the freaking things. I think we'll do it over this. Because I think I'm loving that up there. I got a lot more to do on it. It's going to take me a while to do this. But um, I won't bore you with another video of, oh, Cal, you're doing it over the dots that you loved. How did I get those dots? I don't have to look. Get them again. Um, I won't bore you with like 20 videos of me doing this. But, uh, you know, I'll do a new canvas next. But as I do it and as I, uh, when I finish it, then I'll show you. But, the, you know, it takes a lot of layers to sit and play and wait for things to dry. That's what I do not like. Come here, baby. Get on there. Oh, I wish I had his little stapler. I could staple that on. No, I couldn't. I couldn't get that through the other end. This is like a cardboard, which um, I hate. <laughs> I hate it. Because it's so thick. You just got to keep doing it. Pushing it down till um, it stays. Okay. Stay, baby, stay. All right. Okay. So, yeah. So, what have you guys been watching? I'm going to tell you, I watch Creative C all day. <laughs> I watch sewing and just that kind of stuff, or I don't watch anything. Um, at night when we sit down, that's when we start watching. And I'm just pushing around these corners because I want that glue to dry. A lot of documentaries we watch. Like, did oh, did any of you guys watch um, American Nightmare on night on Netflix? Oh my God! Let me know down below if you did. Holy moly! Holy moly to the end! <laughs> Holy moly! That's all I'm gonna say. Oh look, I could put this right here. Um, yeah. So, if you haven't seen it, watch it. Yeah. Because what I love about these 
is with the blue coming out the back, it almost look like it looks like it's embroidered on. And I'll hold that up to you later once I'm done. Like I said, this is dark now because, you know, I've been all over it and with the pen, but I'm not worried about that. We're going to fix it. We're going to do some things. Okay. Then I got some text. <sighs> so... I don't know what book this is from. But I read, what I read was, something broke inside me. And that's kind of what I wanted to put on here. Might not be for this one, though. So maybe I'll take the bottom off. Because I like to have text, you know. And you know what I might do? I might go like... And just kind of do it like that. Let's see. Everything's kind of catty corner. But that's how I'm going to roll with it. Okay. Like you see how it gives it like some movement and stuff like that? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to, yeah, okay. I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to go a little bit more. Rip it again. Just very, I do like the threes. I do like an odd number. And then I'll just rip that. Okay. And you can still see what's underneath. Okay. Now you don't have to put glue on top. Whatever you're using, you don't have to. Um, I don't know why. I guess I do to keep it down, but um, you don't have to. You could just lay that baby in there like that. See those little ends? And uh, you're good. You don't have to put it all over. It's up to you. It's your painting. All right. And then I got these, which were in a magazine or something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I do like, I do like that. Hmm, Moulin Rouge, I love that one. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. What else do I got? A whole mess of stuff here. All right, these are some, oh, I pulled some of these stickers out, didn't I? Oh, she's back to being disorganized. But I can't help it. All right, I'm just going to get them from here. And let's see what we got. I'm just laying them down. Not real sure. I like layering. Camera. Oh, everything you should have said. Oh, my God. like my life every day. Vintage. No, thank you. Hmm. Maybe text on top of text. Just going with it now. Mm -hmm. Pushing it over that. I don't know if I like this here. I like that blue better, so I think we'll stick with that. What else do we got? That, I know. Step by step, day by day. Okay, let's put this down since I know. That cardboard. You know what, Kelly? Those are stickers. I don't like trying to steal. 
I, you know what? What, what, what am I? Oh my God, the medicine that I'm on really makes me loopy and crazy. And it's not even like I took anything before. This, I, uh, it's just my normal medicine. But I know these are stickers, that's why I bought them. Yeah, they're stickers. You gotta be kidding me. And I'm putting glue on them. Come on. Now we're gonna spend 20 minutes while Kelly tries to get the sticker open. If there were a sticker taker offer, I would buy it. Cause this really bites. I got it, okay. Yeah, cause the cardboard, I'm like, it won't stick. Buy cardboard. Oh my God, it's the bane of my existence. Here we go. Oh my God, look at that. Cardboard who? No, I'm just push it down. Push it down. <laughs> I still would probably put some underneath there. Same with this one. I'm going to peel it up and take it off. But I will put a little glue underneath just because I can see that peeling up. And that's only because of this. Because I have glue on it and I've made a mess. Am I the only one that does stupid stuff like this? My goodness. You're going to see those things all over my studio. So... All over my art room. Okay. Mm. I don't know why I felt the need to smell it, but I did. I want rejuvenate to show. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And just push that down. And then take a little bit under here. Okay, so now this just has to dry before I go on to anything else, um, but I will show you what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do with this. I have, which I love this, it's um, from Folk Art, it is Treasure Gold. This is in gold, comes in a bunch of colors. I'm going to shake it, and what I'm going to do is the littlest bit on my finger and I know the blue is going to get covered the turquoise and that's okay I can go back over with turquoise once this dries because it's going to be lifted the texture so I can go over it but this will bring back some of my gold and just lighten it up a little bit yeah, I like I, I like that. And when I hold it up, you'll see it. It's hard to kind of see right now. Angie, I got your elephant. Thank you so much. I love it. Shayla, I got your card. Thank you so much. I love it. Uh, they're going to be, I'm going to start putting up art that's sent to me again. Like I remember I used to do that and, um, they're going to, everything's going to go up on the wall. So I appreciate every time you guys send me, I know Shayla, you, uh, send me letters and cards all the time. So does Angie and I appreciate it so much. I know sometimes it's like, I might forget to say it, but I do. So thank you. And once I get my life together, maybe I can be able to send some stuff back. Danielle, you as well. Emily got your card. I loved it. I love, uh, you know, the cards that you send me. Again, going to be around the room. I don't need to do this because it's already got it on it. It worked out good. So let me show you how this looks. Which if I had more of this, I might have to go get some. You see how that looks almost embroidered around that? I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, so you see the shine and all that? Then what I want to do is I'm going to have to lay this flat for a moment. So, and I'm going to do this now because that way I can leave it all dry. But I can kind of show you what I want to do. 
I have some glitter. I have some of this. And I'm going to go in and I'm going to ever so slightly, because this jar is clear, follow the curves of the flower. Okay. And get in there, you know, as much as you can. do it here. Heard my phone go off. I'm sorry. Okay. How long is this video? Oh geez, it's 45 minutes. I'm so sorry guys. Now nobody will really watch the video. It's too long. Okay. I'm having fun anyway. But something fun you can do is open this to the edge. You can pick your favorite color glitter. This is why everything's screwed up because I just throw dirty brushes and everything. And I just had this glitter sitting here and that gave me the idea. I'm gonna just tap it in. Tap, tap, tap. In the middle. Let's see, because, you know, in my mind, I'm like, oh, yeah, will it work? Who the hell knows? All right, so I'm just going to pick a page here to dump it on when I'm done. Just kind of move it around, get it in those corners. dump it this way oh yeah and you know what it's gonna have a little bit of glue a little glitter but it just adds to it now the black is not showing like I, I want it to so once it's dry I can go back in to you know get it off and honestly I could probably wait to dust until it's all done. And then outline it. I don't know. Can you see that? Yep. Very, very nice. Okay, let me pour it in here. I hate wasting, but I do waste. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I can't I can't win no matter what I do. Okay, then we'll fill in there. That's okay. Yeah. You know why the gold paint was still wet? And that's okay. I'm just going to go in. I want this thick because I want it to dry. Like, um, almost resin-like, but not. Does that make sense? <laughs> so I'm just going to lay that in there with these just tap it on okay and then we'll see what that comes out like if it comes out like shit then I know don't do it anymore but then I could clean it um, and and like outline do you know what I mean in my head it works trust me <laughs> but I also can like put like a little let's see if that would work little um no nope nope that ain't gonna work we're just gonna go back on that and do it like that see i knew it come off for a reason yeah and i'll just leave it to watch your eyes quit playing with it cal <laughs> She ain't pretty, but she gonna be drying. 
Okay. So that's kind of where I'm at. Like I said, hard to see. The glue has to dry yet. And then I'm going to go back in with, like I can do it here. And just really outline it. So it like shows up, but it's wet and you know, I don't want to play with it right now. I do, but I don't, you know what I mean? So that's all I'm going to do today. That's it. That's it. I know it doesn't look like much, but I have more things, more layers, more paint, more things. So when I'm done with it, I'll show you what it looks like. These are just layers. Like it's just a piece of, um, you know, a layer, just a layer. <clears throat> and other than that, I think the next one I do, um, my next canvas that I want to do a background on, I want it to be more um, dark. So maybe we'll do some um, like dark purple. Do you know what I mean? Like dark purple and um, maybe some black, dark blue. Like not that right because that's a pretty blue I want like a dark night sky blue and then maybe we'll throw a I don't know I don't know what our other color will be I'm just cleaning up um I love you guys thank you I don't care one or ten of you watch thank you so much for humoring me today and uh as always please be kind to each other and please be kind to me um please be kind to each other Everybody you know is fighting some sort of battle, trust me. And it ain't easy sometimes. So I love you guys. I hope you have a great evening. Stay safe. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.